last day on the water. We were just waiting for the tractor to go down and pull out a boat down there, and then once they're done pulling him out, we'll go ahead and motor over. And Come on, girl. Let's go. You gonna help Layla outside? Oh, we're gonna go haul out. We're gonna go on land now. <laughs> we gotta help Layla out because she's getting a little bit old. <clears throat> In doctor's orders, not to let her jump down and to help her up the ladder. So that's what we're doing. Okay, like she's an old lady. Yeah, I think I think we're. It's almost time because he, the tractor just went down. They're hooking it up. So yeah. last day on the water. <laughs> good this summer. The boat feels so weird when it's out of the water. <laughs> so, I still feel like I'm moving. <laughs> bun bun. <laughs> that was a little toy. Well, here we are. Hold up. Hee <laughs> hee. Going in a different building this year. Yeah, going on this one. Wow, we're back in a car again. Weirdness. It's really weird. <laughs> Is this weird, Layla? She didn't care. She's like, whatever. It's fine. <laughs> radio. Oh, wow, music? We haven't had a radio this year because our radio is... <laughs> Started. Took a minute. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> I sprayed the hell out of the belt and everything up there with WD-40. Yeah. Wow. We're driving in a car. This is weird. The difference between the hull on Norton and the hull on the uh, Corn Arabella. Yeah, I'd Corn Arabella, and that's Norton. Yeah, Norton is full. There's definitely a cutaway right here where Norton is just yeah. like. And this is how I look with washed hair. <laughs> we better take care of them. We better take care of this truck before we don't let it rust out. This thing. Yeah. It's pretty amazing. Look at that. So blonde when I wash it. Not that it had, it'd only been like maybe a week. Good morning. Um, we ran out of water this morning. So it's it's gonna rain all day. So I set up the rain collection system and we'll just fill up the water tanks with that. Making some breakfast. Pete makes breakfast every morning. He has for the last 14 years. <laughs> Give or take a few weeks that I did at one point. <laughs> but for the most part, man, I just made breakfast every single day. It's just being very real. I know, but and bananas today. And bananas. We got. We went to. The, we're in the land of plenty right now. We're we're hauled out, so we went to the grocery store. We made some fish stew last night, and we got yeah. scallops and. Oh, oh my gosh! So oh, excited. On our list. Yeah. No one is dripping yeah. on our list. Yeah. I could make a pie, but all I have is buckwheat flour. I mean, I could make something out of buckwheat flour. Our only drawer aboard. <laughs> this is why we're glad we got called out. Whoa. The air temperature was 
59 degrees. The sea water temperature was 62 degrees. The wave height was 6 feet and the period was 5 seconds. That's offshore. The There's a nice wave somewhere. Degrees. The sea temperature yeah. was 62 Burr. degrees. The wave height was 2 feet and the period was 3 seconds. In Jordan Basin, the wind was in east winds 15 to 20 knots, becoming north late. Gusts up to 30 knots. Seas 3 to 5 feet. Patchy fog this morning. Rain with isolated thunderstorms until early afternoon, then rain likely late. Visibility 1 to 3 nautical miles. Tonight, northwest winds 10 to 15 knots with gusts up to 25 knots. Seas 3 to 5 feet. Scattered showers. Friday, northwest winds 10 to 15 knots. Seas 2 to 4 feet. Oh, A chance of showers yeah. in the morning. Friday night, northwest winds 5 to 10 knots. Is it rain tomorrow? Seas 2 to 3 feet. Chance of showers. Here's the forecast. Night, so a little bit maybe in the morning. All right. Well organizing our lives, trying to figure out what to do with different things, where, what goes where, on and on. Whew. It's a lot. It's cleaning. Viking horns. <laughs> wow. That's all cleaned up here now clean and salted and wiped down and totally just organized and uh, he had to patch that spot right there because there was a little um, some corrosion happening so he patched that and cleaned up the the tin or whatever metal that is we haven't, we're not really sure but um, probably metal so that the galvanized doesn't mess with it or whatever which it has over the years uh, we've actually We've actually owned this chain for 14 years. Um, still looks good, but we're thinking of maybe looking at it and seeing if we can get a good price on some chain. We gotta get some for Blossom anyway. So yeah, step one was that. We actually uh, um, we actually put the chain out and spray painted every 50 feet. Um, and we might we might replace this chain, but if we don't, then at least it's end for end. It's been rinsed, and uh, and then it'll be ready to put away. So, so basically, I'm gonna spend the day sanding, sanding every last piece of wood that we have that we own. <laughs> it's gonna be a long day of that. Pete's going to do a day of heat gunning the decks, making sure all of the seams are not leaking anymore, repairing different various things, putting plugs, whatever he needs to do for the decks. Yep, yep. Boring day. But it's got to be done. At least it's nice out. And I'm going to wear a bikini. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, it's a little bit shadowy here to film, but I think I can get the gist of it. So go along with this little guy and just push on every one of these plugs. Like this one, I could tell is soft uh -huh. and loose. And that one, you can kind of see it. You can kind of see there's a gap, but it feels tight. Uh -huh. So basically for this process we're doing right now is he's heating up the seams and just kind of scraping them. And if he sees a bubble, he smooths out the bubble. So there's that for that. And that's what we're going to do right now. I am sanding down everything. These hatches uh, are put down with regular caulking, so I can actually use a sander on this versus the tar you have to scrape. Uh, but basically just getting everything sanded for maintenance. I'm also doing a little bit heavy, heavier sanding where I'm noticing um, I never got a chance to really do the varnish very well kind of doing those sort of things this year, which is sort of nice to be able to do. I 
down, I'm thinking of sanding the uprights. But I'll do that one year. Yeah. Decks are all scraped. Nice, nice. Finding various plugs that are bad. Fluffy, fluffy. He's like, don't even come near me. <laughs> it really isn't. You worried about anything there, sir? Kind of cute. They're kind of cute. They look soft. I know. Look like you're like this little soft bunny. His little face. Maybe. Maybe like I know this dog. Whoa. <laughs> he put his butt to me. I'm out of here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to find out. <laughs> That's where they come out is out that part. <laughs> okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> I only got porcupine one time. That is no bueno.